Okay folks, welcome back. Today we're going to be checking out these three hives right here. These are some captured swarms that I got out of, out of my work. Um, <clears throat> all three of them had bees in them when I checked them the other day and then this morning when I put them in the, in the truck to take them home here. Um, so let's, uh, we're going to check them out here, kind of see what, what's in them. Um, it had been a couple weeks since I had, I had looked when I uh, checked here earlier this week. And realize there was bees in them so they've either been in there you know a week or two probably not too long um, this one here in the middle this is the one that I same location that I caught the swarm earlier there are bees in it I'm really hoping it's not just all field bees but uh, looks like they're different colored so anyways we're gonna look at them anyway kind of see what we got there gonna try to beat this rainstorm we got coming in and hopefully we can get this checked out so let's uh, let's have a look here and see what we got. All right, this one was on the north end of the property. Not that that really means anything. It's just kind of how I marked them. Got a bunch of ants. Up here. That's gonna cause troubles. It has been a little bit cool today, a little cloudy. So this looks like it's about two, maybe three frames of bees. I put a couple, a couple uh, drawn frames in here for bait. So that always, you know, like I mentioned in previous videos, that always helps to catch uh, new swarms. They've got a bunch of bunch of stuff drawn out. It's all funky. So I'll examine the next one. I'll clean that up here. Hopefully, you know, these aren't like virgin swarms and there's actually a laying queen in there. seen some eggs in there got eggs so that's good no sign of the queen yet I do not see any eggs on this side. So that means the queen must be over here. If she's uh, she's got eggs there. Let's see if we can track her down. She's gonna be an Italian. These are little light lighter colored bees. Not like the first one where they were Russian. So this is some kind of an Italian genetics. There are just a small patch of eggs right in here. So it could have been a virgin swarm and they ended up landing in here. I guess that's fine. If I don't find the queen today, it's not that big a deal because I can see there's eggs. And since it's sprinkling, it'll be a pretty quick inspection. Not much on that that side either. So. Anyways, this one uh, looks looks okay. They just looks to me like if it was a virgin swarm, she had just started laying because they're just a small small patch of eggs there. This is all nectar on this side here. Uh, 
try to clean some of this up here before they get too crazy. Make a bunch of brace comb. It's always funny with bees the way they draw. Some some of them will do just perfect, and then others will do like this. Just make a mess. But that's the way it is. There is a little bit of a cluster of bees in the top box. There's no no drawn uh, comb. I'm not gonna really mess with them. I see them kind of clustered up in there, so the queen could be up above. But we're gonna leave her. We got eggs. Uh, so I'm, I'm concerned about with that one. Alright, next one here. Get things adjusted. Now this one here, as I mentioned, uh, this is in the location of the original swarm I caught. And hopefully uh, a new swarm moved in. It's just not field bees but regardless we're getting on Memorial Day here so it's nope this looks like it's another swarm got uh, three or four frames of bees here lighter lighter colored bees again Got it packed nice, honey and pollen, and I see eggs in there, so there's a queen. So we caught us another swarm here. This one I had reset after I had uh, gotten that colony home. I just, uh, that day I, I put another swarm trap out in the same exact location, but again I haven't, I haven't checked it for a couple weeks. And so apparently this one moved right in. Doesn't look like a tremendously big swarm. But we got uh, some capped brood. Lots of eggs. Kind of a there's a shotgun pattern there. Got a lot of eggs in there. This side's much better. A lot of, a lot of kept brood and uh, ringed with younger larvae. Hopefully we can find the queen here. She won't be too camera shy. Not seeing her on that one. So, the location I have it, it's about, it's in my work, I mentioned it's about 30 miles north of where I live right now. And uh, apparently it's a pretty good spot for swarms because this is uh, the third going on. I'm going to check the next one here. It'll be the fourth swarm we caught out there. Can't beat that. Four colonies of free bees. May end up requeening all these, but uh, for now. For now we got uh, four little nukes of bees. seeing her. Uh, that's alright. We got a queen. I'll do this last frame. Maybe she's on this last frame. They were kind of bounced around in the, in the pickup truck. After I 
picked them up, took the boys fishing, and they kind of bounced around a little bit. So I don't tell them where she's at. Well, there she is. Right there. Little Italian girl. Right here she is. Not marked. But we will fix that right now. I'm going to assume she's a 2020 queen. She was a virgin. Uh, they wouldn't blade this well, so she was already bred moving in. All right, so we got another, another, another queen, another nuke. Like I said, there's about three, maybe four frames of bees, and it's laid up pretty well, so they're gonna build up nice here. They'll be their their population will be uh, increasing here rapidly here in the next. Uh, week or so once they hatch get that second hatch going all right and lastly this one I'm gonna call the west one uh, when I picked this one up it felt fairly heavy really in the top box and this one has about three frames of bees two two and a half frames these bees are dark, dark colored. See a fair amount of honey. I do see some drone brood, so that tells me there is a queen in this one as well. Alright, gotta kneel down here. This is all new drawn, so we got honey, pollen, no eggs on this frame. Starting to draw it this side. Got eggs and pollen. Let's see if we can find the queen on this side. She's gonna be a dark little girl. She might even be laying. And these bees moving. Got more sprinkles. So not too much on this side. 
to some drone cells, so I don't know, maybe we got a, a virgin that didn't make it back. So we have some older larvae on this side, but uh, they're not old enough to cap yet. To tell if this is going to be like a lane, lane worker situation. I have not found her yet. This frame holds. Maybe she's on this frame. A lot of pollen and honey on this one. There are a lot of bees down the bottom of the box. It could be down there too. See anything on this side other than honey? We got a lot of honey. So I guess this this hive right now I'm going to classify as to be determined. So we got some eggs, but I have not found the queen. So I'm not 100% sure yet if we got a laying queen. I do see eggs, but I do see some drone. So we could have a lane worker, but this was a virgin, virgin swarm and she did not make it back. So there are a lot of bees on the side of the box in the bottom. I just kind of moved them here. They've just been settled in not too long. Take one more look just to see if I can't find her. Just to stand up out of the, the view of the camera here. At first uh, swarm, it took me a couple inspections to find the queen. She was a hider. They haven't drawn out these comb yet like they've got it grown, but it's the pattern. I don't see multiple eggs or anything. So she did lay, she just started laying. But this side here has got drone. So sure what to think on this one yet guys may have to give it a give it a few days here and come back and check them out see if I can't dig in here and figure out what's going on it's this uh, side here just all honey and pollen expect her to be on this frame, but you never know. Well, I guess we're going to have to say for now this one is uh, to be determined. There are a fair amount of bees. You know, it's like I said, it's uh, two, to, two to three frames of bees. 
the way they're behaving there, I'm, I'm thinking it's a uh, queenless, queenless colony. So we'll give it a, we'll give it a couple more days, and uh, once we get them settled in, I'll check them out, see what we got. It's hoping, uh, hoping for a queen, but we don't have one right now that I can tell. All right. That's it for now. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.